Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got this blue and red triangles inscribed in a circle as you can see in this uh, diagram such that this angle ADB is represented by 5Y plus 2 and moreover this angle ACB is represented by 2x minus 1 and this angle OAB is 63 degrees and now we are going to solve for x plus y please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe so let's go ahead and get started with the solution and here's the very first thing we are going to do in order to solve for x plus y we must solve individually for x and y first and here's our very first step let's focus on this uh, triangle ABO and we can see that this is an isosceles triangle since this side is equal to this side so therefore if this angle is 63 degrees this angle has got to be 63 degrees as well and now let's recall triangle sum theorem according to this theorem the sum of the three interior angles in a triangle is always equal to 180 degrees so therefore if this angle is 63 degrees this angle is 63 degrees as well so then uh, this angle has got to be 54 degrees if we add all these three angles they must add up to 180 degrees so therefore our this angle AOB turns out to be 54 degrees as you can see over here and now let's go ahead and make an observation we can see these three angles this first angle ADB this angle ACB and this this angle AOB are subtended by this very same arc AB and moreover this angle AOB is at the center whereas these two angles ADB and this angle ACB are the angles at the circumference and now let's recall the central angle theorem the angle at the center is twice the angle at the circumference so therefore this angle at the center AOB is going to be twice the angle at this uh, circumference uh, ACB so therefore we can write that this angle AOB equals to two times the angle ACB we know our angle AOB is 54 degrees let me go ahead and write down 54 degrees equal to two times the angle ACB is represented by 2x minus 1 now let's go ahead and divide both sides by 2 and on the left hand side that is going to give us uh, 27 degrees equal to this 2 and 2 is gone so we ended up with the 2x minus 1 let's go ahead and add 1 on both sides this is gone so therefore our 2x turns out to be 27 plus 1 is going to make a 28 and let's divide both sides by 2 so therefore our x value simply turns out to be 14 degrees and here's our next step now we can see that this angle AOB at this center is twice of this angle ADB as you can see over here in this equation and we know our angle AOB is 54 degrees therefore let me go ahead and write down 54 degrees equal to 2 times our angle ADB is represented by this 5y plus 2 let's go ahead and solve for y so I'm going to divide both sides by 2 and we can see that this 2 and 2 is gone on the left hand side we got 27 degrees equal to 5y 
plus 2. Let me go ahead and subtract 2 from both sides. This is gone. So therefore, our 5y value turns out to be 25 degrees. So therefore, our y value turns out to be 5 degrees. So thus we figured out our x value is 14 degrees and y is 5 degrees. So therefore our x plus y value is going to be simply, let's go ahead and add those two angles, 14 degrees plus 5 degrees. That is going to be equal to 19 degrees. So thus our final answer turns out to be 19 degrees. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.